Today we'll be focusing on how to use Microsoft PowerPoint, the application version on iOS. We'll focus on Microsoft Excel, the application version on iOS, some other day. But do not tune out, because you will miss important directions on how to use Microsoft PowerPoint and how to edit properly. Enjoy! After you have downloaded the application, you will launch the application, and as it loads in, we will go through different tutorials along with me. If you would like to watch this on another device, pause the video now. First off, when you first pop in, you will be under the Recents tab. If you don't have any recent applications, just click over into the Create New tab. So in the Create New tab, you have several different filters. As I scroll through, I want you to decide which one you want. So there are several different ones. There's Organic Wood, um, just to name a few, Frame Wood Type, and Mesh, Savon, I know, sorry, some of these are complex names for nuts, but for the sake of the video, we're going to use Organic Dark. So once Organic Dark loads in, or any filter you've used, just follow these few directions. What we're going to focus on first, you'll pop up with this screen, but what we don't focus, focus on first is the A in the pencil tab. That is how you add text or add transitions that you want through each slide. The next one over is the um, share button. You share that to your friends and family. Then there's the play button, which you will play the slide. But then there's also located at the bottom screen is new slides. Um, so basically, you have several different slides that you can add in. Picture with caption, blank, content with caption, and so forth and so on. You can also print some of these if you have a printer located. But we're not going to get into that in this video. We are going to type something completely random. We're going to type hello. So what you can do is if you have a box you don't want, you can just cut it by tapping on it and you'll pop up with these bars. We're going to focus on cut. So once you cut it, your thing will look like this. So you can just add a new slide or you can highlight the um, word that you have written and you can use it. Um, animations, but we're going to focus on insert first. What you do with insert is that um, once we get over there, but then there's design, there's transitions, and animations, and then there's slide. That just adds new slides and stuff, not really much to focus on. So in insert, you'll see new slide, ta table, and picture. Then there's shapes, text box, and video. Text box and video once you scroll further down. In design section, you'll see themes, slide, size, and fill in color thingy. And then inside the trans transitions, we have transition effects. There are several different transitions, but we'll get into that later. The same thing with animations. There's entrance effect, emphasis effect, exit effect, and um, how to edit that. That will be all for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you want any more tutorials like this, just comment below. I'll see you guys later. Bye.